Hi, this is Heather Coleman, your intuitive medium. Really happy that my daughter Nadia uh -huh. is joining us for this week's reading. Yes. We're doing November 7th through November 13th. Um, and in fact, November 7th, tomorrow is what day? Why don't you tell everyone? My birthday! Yeah. Tell everyone how old you're going to be. Nine. Yeah. And so, um, Nadia is a very gifted medium in her own right, and we felt it was time that she offers a little bit of her gifts with this reading, and so Nadia was the one who chose the three cards, the decks they were to be chosen from, and even the order that we're doing the cards today. So our first card is from the Magical Mermaids and Dolphins Oracle deck by... Dory Virtue. Dory Virtue. And our first card is Dream Big. This is saying to you to dream big. Don't even if it's so far in your life, mm -hmm. still still try. Mm -hmm. Don't leave that past in your dreams. Just try, even if it's such a change in your life. Yeah, set those big dreams, even if it's hard to see the way your life is now to the way those dreams would come through for you. Still. Focus on those dreams. Ashley <coughs> ran off on us. Ashley, our intuitive <coughs> cat, was here with us. Yep. And um, now the second card, Nadia was very clear that this card was second. I, I even thought it was third. It's from the Conscious Spirit deck by Kim Dreyer. And would you like to hold this card up, Nadia, so everyone can see it? Not too I'm close. Oh, yeah. But it, you have to hold it still. Embrace change. And Nadia, in particular, had a message that was really clear. So why don't you share that, Nadia? Can't you see how she's she's going even though it's a very big change? She's still trying. So you have to try even if it's just going to be such a big change in your life. Still, if it's such a big change in your life, try and make the best of it, not the worst of it. And that really goes along with dreaming big, right? Being yeah. able to see that big change and Nadia says embrace that change even if you doubt it and even if it's hard, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, the third and final card is from the Angel Tarot deck by uh, Doreen Virtue and Radley Valentine. And we've got the <coughs> Nine of Earth, which is really about personal satisfaction. The message here is that by following the advice of these first two cards, dream big and embrace those changes, that you're going to get to that personal satisfaction, which has a lot to do with having enough money and enough time, enough to really feel comfortable, and enough to feel like, I've got time for little luxuries and little yep. indulgences. Did you have anything else to say about that, Nadia? Nothing. You sure? No. Okay. Yeah. yeah, yeah. She wants to know if she can bring Ashley back over here, and I'm saying yeah. And so while she's going to get Ashley, our intuitive cat, I'm going to tell you that the website is strengthontherun.com. And check out the Facebook page. Let us know how this reading resonates with you. And Nadia's just going to really quick bring Ashley here for a quick wrap up here. We're enjoying the wrong here that my deceased grandma left with us. This is Ashley. Our little kitty. And wishing you a happy week. November 7th through 13th. Thank you for joining us. us. Have a beautifully happy, happy and healthy day. day.